Hey folks, how y'all doing today? Doing an update on my uh, my on grid off grid system with that my Outback Power systems um, on on and off grid inverter on and off grid inverter excuse me and my Kerosera solar panels and I got 20 2,310 watts of power of solar power and I got 1,400 watts of wind power total so mine's a system is a hybrid system but here you go I'm gonna let you we'll take a look from a distance here and anyway here we go that's my system this is August the 24 and those are my small off-grid system panels over there I got uh, right at 200 watts of that or 190, 195 watts of my small off-grid system run my Run my attic fans and different fans inside there, and those are my 140 watt here Sarah solar panels. Um, excuse me, those are 135 here Sarah, and these are my 140 waters, five of them. And yeah, they're doing a heck of a job. And. Those, those are UL solar solar panels, 140 watts right there. And I got them both at both sets of pole mounts on 60, at 61 degrees right now for the, for the month of August in Virginia. That's what it calls for. So yes sir, yes ma'am, and yes sir. So yeah, it's producing a lot of power today. It's uh, temperature's not real hot. It's about 80, I think around 82 degrees out here. Humidity's fairly low. And the wind is about going about two to four mile an hour, and it is it is kicking. That's the wind turbine that I uh, did the other day and put the seal coat on there. That Eastwood uh, two part epoxy slash ceramic uh, paint clear coat. Excuse me. Yeah, she's doing it, and that's a uh, HY four hundred uh, twenty at twenty four volt. But it's one of them still hot days. We had a lot of rain yesterday. But yeah. Alright, I'm good to I'm gonna show you what the system's doing right now. Alright. Okay, here we go. Alright. Neighbors out there cutting grass. But yeah, these panels are booming. Really booming. They got these ones on the back. They're not producing much now. They're kind of in the shade, but they're there. All right. So we got here. All right. A little bit of an update. So right, here we go. All right. Taking a little tour. What we got going on here? Want to have a bar? Got to have. Want to have a barbecue this evening? Got some ribs cooking in there. My other video I just did. Got the hot tub open, getting ready to go swimming. After a while. Oh yeah. So yep, I got all that stuff running on my system. And I still got a run the hot tub, the house, 1500 watts. Uh, I mean, excuse me, 1500 square foot. And plus I'm running my building out here. I got a 100 amp service out there. And it's still kicking. The system's still doing good. But I'll keep y'all updated throughout the winter and all. It's fall, winter, spring, summer. <laughs> and look at that, look at that, look at that. Uh, those are my little uh, benches. Get them bad boys eat. They are something else. I can fill that thing up full of food and it'll be gone within a couple days. That old Niger seed. They love eating that stuff. Yep, they go to town. That thing's shaking. Not me, y'all. It's the bird. And a little bit of wind. And right below it. I don't know if you can see. But. Doves like to hang out down there. Morning doves. 
sitting out there right now. I'm just spooky. But anyway, let's go inside and I'll see what's going on here. Alright. Check something here. Yeah, that's some other part of the shop. Put the air conditioner out of there. Got a fan going in there. And that's my little small off-grid system. And that's reading right now, excuse me, yeah. They're reading 100 percent on the battery bank. And right there. We're at 13.2 volts. Doing a heck of a job. Yeah. So yeah, they're staying the same. But let me let me turn some lights on for you. I'm not sure to show you a little bit of everything. LED lights. And two for us. Let's see right here. 13.2 volts. And I got that set up for watts. That's what we're bringing in right now. I'll plug my air breeze. I got it hooked up in my ceiling up there. I'll plug it in. There we go. Look at that. See, it's bringing the power in. There you go. Load amps 2.0. That's all running two amps. And how many, this how many amps, four, five amps, 4.7, we're bringing in. So this ain't a hundred percent charge. And uh, anyway, that's, that's my attic fan. I got this air breeze right here. 12 volt air breeze, that's going up there to my, up in my attic space. I don't know if you see the fan or not. There it is, yeah, there you go. There she is. I think I'm sucking up the heat too now. Keeping it cool. Alright, just want to show you how to do that, what I did. And that's coming out of that gable vent right here. Coming out right here. The air is coming out. The hot air. Anyway, all right. Let's go show you what my system is doing today. I got the AC going in here. Woo oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right. We got one fan going up there. We turn that down low. We we'll can hear ourselves talk. And the air conditioner set it at 75 degrees. That's another little LED light bulb. Those things are bad. Look at that. Oh yeah, saving energy. Making energy, making energy and saving energy. I got them off eBay. So so far so good. All right, conditions for today. Uh, temperature out. Max is 83.6. Got about a two mile an hour in the wind, two mile, two mile an hour wind from the north, northeast. Kind of a dirty wind. Best conditions right now. 50% humidity, perfect conditions outside right now. Nice and cool. Cooler anyway, y'all. And it's 3.20 in the afternoon. Uh, it's August 24th. Anyway, I'm on, uh, I'm on, uh, well, the underground if you want to check my station out. On this KVA Chest 28 or either Stafford Place. But right now, we are producing uh, got a cloud cover right now. We're producing. Alright, it's coming back up now. We're producing. About 1400 watts of power, 1500 watts, and 1.1 1 .1 or 1100 watts is going back to, to the house and to the, everything I've got running. 
and today so far we have produced seven point okay one point five kilowatt hours right now and seven point six kilowatt hours this thing is a bomb all right I'm gonna do this for you this right here is the inverter button right here now I'm going to graph right here it tells you the battery voltage right now it tells you everything that's going on but I'm going to graph the inverter and that's what we inverted today so far that's a night and that was yesterday it rained yesterday look at that that's hard to believe but look at today that graph is solid today that much power we're putting out all right that's invert charge we hadn't used a charge anything today the batteries are good buy we hadn't bought, had it bought any power to charge any batteries up and sell that's what we sold today or what's going back into the house about the same as invert but yeah it's doing pretty that's pretty neat but anyway back uh, AC in and out. Let's see here. AC in and out is 122 volts and 123 volts. I hope this is clear for y'all. Um, but yeah, that's what it's doing right now. Invert. Uh, just, we just had cloud cover. But you'll have that. Two of the better votes are at. Alright. Sorry about the quality of this film, but anyway, I just wanted to give y'all an update. Back and right here, this is what we're doing to the grid right now. Um, cell status mode. We're bringing in a, a grid 122 volts mode. Buying. Uh, not buying right now. What I can still okay. Let's see it go up here in a minute. A sun pops out to do all kind of neat things. Okay. Grid stats mode. So all right. Put one zero zero point kilowatts. This thing will tell you everything. Everything except for what you haven't presented this evening. Um, and see the maximum voltage, 120 volts, and minimum, excuse me, maximum 128 volts, 737 the times. All right. Got a cloud cover. All right. Let's see if the thing is if it's going to do its thing. Something pop out. We're drop, bringing in about 200 watts right, right now. Now we're in about 192 watts. That's over here. Yeah, good cloud cover right now. Should have jump up here in a minute, y'all. We're hoping anyway. There's a nice cloud up there. <laughs> Anyway, we could sit here all day and wait, but and it's 3:24 p.m. in the afternoon. Um, so, all right, come on, man, jump up. 200 watts right now on the solar. All right, it's doing something now. We just jumped up. All right, now hold up. We got something going on here now. Alright. Yeah, I think the sun is starting to pop out now. Alright, we're selling back all. Whoop. Alright. 95 watts. That's a heck of a cloud. But anyway. Alright. After it gets above 200 watts. It starts feeding more power back in the house. It needs a certain amount of power to keep the batteries 
up to par during the day. When the sun is out and at night it just they just sleep. Batteries stay charged. Alright. Uh, Alright, sun work with me. But anyway, oh well. Um I'm seeing it 200 watts right now. Let's go back. Yep, we're staying at 0.200 watts. 200 watts, or we're staying at right now. But that's a big cloud. All right. Well, anyway, y'all. <laughs> sorry about that. You know how the wind or the sun won't cooperate with you when you need it to. But this is a. Uh, whoa! Sorry about that. Man, it's ugly mug shot. There we go. Anyway, y'all, I just want to say thank y'all for watching. And hey, y'all have a good one. And uh, y'all come on back again. And thank you for watching my videos. Please subscribe. This is this is Kenny or KVSMC. Just don't call me late for, or Viral Loss. Just don't call me late for dinner. All right. Y'all take care. Thank you for watching. All right. Bye-bye.